Today we're gonna teach you how to lay some pipe in Half-Life Alex with tile meshes. As always, I like to start with a blank template. Now I am gonna change my grid size down to an eight by eight square. Uh, we're gonna go over to our block tool and we're gonna draw out a quad. Now we're gonna draw the quad and make sure it is exactly eight by eight. Uh, which is easy because you made the grid eight by eight, so it's really just one square. Now you're gonna zoom in, and I zoomed a little bit past it, and you're gonna grab it, you're gonna lift it up. Uh, it's gonna make your life so much easier if you just do that, if you just lift it up. All right, now we're going to right click on that. We're gonna go back into objects mode. We're gonna right click, we're gonna go to selected meshes, and we're gonna create a tile mesh. Now we're gonna alt enter. We're gonna pull up the properties of that, and we're gonna go into this first tile set one. We're gonna look for pipe. Now, you see there are a whole bunch of pipes. We want this one eight pipe. You guys saw we did the eight earlier. If you do a four, you do a 32, you do a two, you can do all the different sizes. They need to match uh, whichever size you did. We did an eight by eight, so we're gonna pick the eight pipe. We'll accept it. We're gonna X out of there and then boom, look, you got a pipe. Now, if you look at it from all angles, you can tell it works. Uh, it doesn't matter that we raised it. Uh, looks good from pretty much every angle. Now we're gonna go into edge mode. We're gonna grab it and we're gonna start playing around with the edges. Now make sure you're in edge mode. We're gonna hold down shift and we're gonna just pull out the edge. Uh, you can pull it out, just make sure you keep it in that eight by eight sizing. If you try to go any wider, uh, it's not gonna work for you. Now if you pull out an edge from one of the, now if you hold shift, pull out an edge and then pull out another edge, look, you see, you make a little, uh, a little side thing. But see, we try to change the width, it ain't gonna work for us. You have to keep it within those little eight by eight dimensions. Now we can pull out another little bit. We just go from there. We just hold shift to keep on pulling. Uh, we'll move the map and you see you can keep making a fancy pipe. And that's really it. Uh, you go into here, you can really do as much detail. You just have to keep it within that little eight by eight grid. So you just keep on the edges, you keep grabbing them. You hold shift, you grab the edge, you hold shift, you pull it out you play around with it. Now we'll show you a little bit more depth to those. So as you see, this is all just kind of like basic looking pipe, but we can do so much more. If we go into the faces, we click on each section, then we right click, go into tile properties, we can go into detail and we can give them some more detail. Uh, now this will make your pipes look a little bit more exciting, a little bit more custom, uh, a little bit more like you put some TLC into those rather than just some stock pipes. You can also go in there and set an end cap, which is pretty cool. So that way you can kind of finish off your pipes uh, if you want to just, you know, lay those pipes, make sure they're perfect, throw those end caps on them, and that's about it. Now, I, I like to do is just kind of rotate it up uh, so you guys can see what we're doing. It is all just one object now. Uh, we're just gonna rotate it on up and I'm gonna pull it on up in here, and there you go. That is it. We have laid some pipe. And might I say that is some beautiful pipe that we have laid right there. There you go. Enjoy, take that, and run with it. Hope that was helpful. I'm Frank, this is The Game Show. We'll see you again soon.